What's going on everybody and welcome back to the channel I'll bring you guys another Pokemon pack opening today We are hunting for the Ultra Ball Gold or a Full Art Espeon Okay, because if I don't pull it right now, I'm gonna be upset And I'm almost done with Sun and Moon Base, so we're gonna finish Sun and Moon Base Master Set I pulled basically all the good things except for the two, three or four things that I want But look, I'm gonna move my camera a little bit See that up there? I got myself a 20th Anniversary Pikachu Today and I'm really excited about it and uh, I need two more Pikachu's for the 20th anniversary set So right here we got ourselves. I don't know how many Sun and Moon base packs, but we got a few Hopefully Sun and Moon usually is really really good and I got these out of just like check lane blisters, so Hopefully we can get something decent Sun and Moon base always usually gives me decent pulls, so I'm hoping right. Oh look at that it's a crimp card. I've never had a crimp card. I don't know if y'all could see those two. They're crimped. The rare better not be crimped. If it is, I'm gonna be a little bit upset. But I won't be upset about a few cards crimped. I, I can live with it. We got a Hurtier, Togedemaru, a Lolan Grimer, Fromantis, Cosmog, Roggenrola, Cloyster Reverse Rare to start out, and a Stoutland Regular Rare. The Ultra Ball is one of the most sought after cards in Sun and Moon era, aside from Rainbow Rare Charizard and the Gold cards. I actually, I think I would, if I were to put put it, I think that the Ultra Ball is more sought after than like Lunala and Gold Solgaleo and Gold Necrozma because it's playable and it will always be playable. So I think that it's a little more sought after than these uh, just normal cards. You know what I'm saying? They're just like the rainbow rares and stuff, except for the select few that are really, really rare, like rainbow rare Charizard. We got a gold duck right there. So, yeah. I don't know, I don't really know. I don't really know. If if it ever rotated, I guess, then it wouldn't be. It would be a lot of people waste a lot of money when this set came out. And I think it's only like a $40 card anymore though, but. Playable wise, it's really good. It's a really cool card to just have in a deck. So these were check lane blisters. So hopefully that the check lane blister gives us the goods. I've done a, quite a few check lane blisters, but I've never done check lane blisters of uh, Sun and Moon. I will give some codes out after these, so you guys can collect yourself some of the promo cards. I didn't think you guys really cared too much about those to start out, and I went and didn't want to waste all your guys' time, so I pre-opened them. You know what I'm saying? You don't want to take up too much of your valuable time. We got a Marini and a Alolan Doug Trio Hollow Rare. I do need quite a few hollows and reverses for this set. So I'm hoping that I can snag them all up as quick or as many as possible. Um, might get on Trolling Toad and get the just commons, uncommons bulk thing that you can get. And then whenever I don't need, I will get rid of. Down the road. Send it to Darium or something. And, uh, yeah. Alright, we are going forward to the front. So far, not so bad. We got ourselves a Hollow Rare. It is always good to get a Hollow Rare. Always good to get a new card. We got an Alolan Diglett, Bound Sweet, Skarmory, Cutie Fly, Drowsy, Team Skull Grunt. I actually need that in a full art as well. Uh, I can't remember. What all I need, but I know I need the SP on full art. I've seen a lot of people be getting that, and y'all super lucky because that card is awesome. That card is a beauty. Right here we go. Here is the next code card. I think Sun and Moon Base is rotating soon. If I'm not mistaken, I think it rotates in August or something like that. So a lot of these cards will not be playable. So the set price will go down, except for probably secret rares. Pretty soon the set's bound to go out of print. We got a Cosmium Reverse and another Primarina Rare. So when the set goes out of print, then uh, usually everything drops. So right here is my dog hair. Right there is a code card for a check lane blister. This one came with a, a Rock Ruff. That's kind of cool. I like it. I, I dig the art of the Rock Ruff. I think this is a Rock Ruff. Yeah, there's Rock Ruff and Trumbeak, I think. So, 
Yeah, here we go. Another rock rough. A lot of rock roughs. Here, we got a Trumbeak next. Right here's another code card for the Check Lane Blister. Then we'll do... Here's the Trumbeak. Or Pikapek, not Trumbeak. What am I thinking? Trumbeak's the next form. We got three packs remaining. Then we'll give out the last of those Check Lane Blisters. I don't know if anybody wants those or uses them. But if you do, let me know. I think I don't know if you get a pack or not, so... I think it's just a promo by just reading it. I think it's just a promo. Hopefully we can get a pull. If we don't get a pull, I'm going to be a little bit balled up because no pulls, no good. Pukabuku. I can never say this Pokemon's name. It's got the wackiest name in the whole Pokemon community, man. Makuhita. That was one of my first shinies I ever caught back in the day was Makuhita. I, if I could ever find that game file, I'd be super happy. We got an Alolan Muck Reverse Rare. That is a new one for me and a Toucanon. Toucan Sam, man. The Fruit Loop Bird right there. All right, here we go. We got two packs remaining. I'm going to give out some more codes after this for the Check Lane Blisters. Come on, Sun and Moon Base. We need a pull. Give us a Secret Rare. Or another Espeon. I'll be happy with just a regular Espeon GX because I just love Espeon GX. I need a Lapras. Honestly, I need a Lapras, which... Would be cool to get. Lapras is awesome. Lapras is an underrated Pokemon, I think. I think he doesn't get the love he deserves. Or she didn't. Carvana. Carvana Unana. Right there. <laughs> we got a Crobat or a Golbat Reverse Uncommon and a Arcanine Hollow Rare. I do have one of these. I need this in a Reverse Rare, I think. I think I only need it in a reverse, so we will grab some of these. Hopefully, we can get that last pack magic. Here we go. We got a rock rough. Right here is the rock rough code. We got a peck peck. Right here is the peck peck code. Don't want hashtag no bots. Right here is the peck peck code. We got two codes remaining. Right here is another rock rough code. Okay, let's guess it. Let's guess it. Pike Peck, Rock Rough. And here is a Pike Peck code. Once again for you guys. Last pack. Can we get a poll to end last pack? These were not very good, but I can't complain because I got some new cards for the master set. Definitely take it. We need that last pack magic Pokemon company. You know, you can't just do this to me. You can't just not give me a poll. Your boy is so used to getting poles that it's it's wacky if I don't, you know. All right, right here we go. We got a fire energy. If we can get a secret rare steel energy, that will be actually really cool. Not holding my breath on that one because those cards are super, super rare. A Lolan Rattata, Cosmog, Rogged Rolla, Growlithe. We just got your master. We got a Primarina Reverse. And the last card is a Hollow Alolan Doug Trio. Twins. Twins, right there. We got Hollow Alolan Doug Trio, Hollow Alolan Doug Trio, and Hollow Arcanine. Not terrible. I can I can't complain. We got some new cards, so wasn't really expecting much. Sun and Moon either is really really good or it's really really bad. So kind of basically like X and Y sets, just basically right after that. So. Alright guys, that's going to be it for the video. Go ahead and like the video. Subscribe if you guys are new. I do post Monday through Friday 9 a.m. Pacific Standard Time. So be sure to turn on those post notifications so you never miss a video. And you get these code cards. I'm signing out. Peace.